Cherry lock riveters have a setting control on the rear of the head assembly that is used to determine how flush rivet stems will break. Adjustments to this setting are required to install longer grip fasteners. The 680A159 gauge is used to adjust the shift point setting and is included with the tool. Fasteners are categorized into groups A, B, and C determined by grip length. All Cherry double action riveters are capable of installing group A fasteners, but the G689 and the G686B-S are the only riveters able to install B and C group fasteners. To adjust the setting, connect the tool to an air source. Remove the collet assembly and the pulling head. Then thread the smaller end of the shift setting gauge into the head piston until snug. Press and hold the trigger so the gauge is pulled into the tool head and use the setting gauge to identify the group for which the tool is set. If installing group A rivets, gauge point A on the setting gauge should be flush with the front of the tool head. Release the trigger and turn the adjuster knob clockwise to increase gauge protrusion or counterclockwise to decrease gauge protrusion. Cycle the tool after each adjustment and check the gauge point until it lines up flush with the tool head. To install group B rivets, remove the limit pin and the adjuster ring. Then turn the adjuster knob six times counterclockwise. Replace the adjuster ring, making sure to align the friction spring with the adjuster knob. Turn the adjuster ring until the limit pin hole aligns with the rear cap hole opposite of where the adjuster knob points. Then replace the limit pin. When adjusted correctly, point B of the setting gauge will be flush with the front of the tool head while holding the trigger. When installing group C rivets, remove the limit pin and turn the adjuster knob 12 times counterclockwise from setting A or 6 times from setting B. When adjusted correctly, gauge point C will be flush with the front of the tool as the trigger is held.